This is West Panorama Ridge on the daylight. And this is West Panorama Ridge at night. The community association in this area was formed uh, to help keep this area rural because 60 years ago this area was had lots of large lots mostly between uh, one to ten acres. People had horses on their property, they had, they had animals, and they wanted to maintain that. So there was development starting to impinge on the ridge, and the people wanted to divide the properties up into smaller parcels for development, and people formed a community association to try to prevent that and keep this area rural. So their definition at the time of what rural was, was keeping the large trees, the, uh, the, the mature trees, uh, keeping ditches, uh, keeping large lots, and not having a lot of street lights. After some dead bodies were found in this area, people became scared of the darkness, and because of that, the West Panorama Ridge Ratepayers Association decided to ask the neighborhood whether if they want street lights or not. With time, obviously, communities change. Uh, most of those really large lots have been developed out. We still have large lots by most standards. Most of them are half acre minimum. But uh, different people move in, uh, crime became more prevalent, and now there's more people thinking that perhaps more streetlights would actually solve our problems as far as reduce the levels of crime. We felt that because there's such a lot of history, and there is a lot of people who still feel strongly about not having lights, we didn't want to have like a simple vote that said, oh, 51% say lights are okay, we just put them all in. We just tell the city to put them all in. And what we, what we wanted to do was a two-part thing. One, to just sort of gauge community opinion, which we've done. And we're finding now that more people tend to say they want lights than don't want lights. But then we want to go to every spot where a light is proposed and, and talk to the houses that ring that light and say, you're, you're going to be right beside a light. Do you want the light? And we were, we originally, our position was going to be that we were not going to recommend to the city to put a light there unless every resident around that light wanted that light. If one resident said, I don't want that light, then we would say, okay, fine, no light. 